Hello friends. Uh, I, I am showing uh, a little utility in my extension pack to create named objects in FreeCAD. Sometimes you need to create uh, objects in FreeCAD to use in expressions. For example, you want to create a spreadsheet with data and use this data in expressions. So you usually create a new spreadsheet, put some data in there, whatever, put an alias in this thing, and you can use this expression in something else for example in a part uh, you create a cube for example and you want some of these dimensions correspond to this variable so just in the expressions engine you select spreadsheet height whatever yeah that's it the problem with this is that you cannot control this name spreadsheet is a name internal name that you can use in expressions. You can change the label, for example, here data, but you cannot use data in the in the expression engine. In the expression engine, you need to use the internal name, spreadsheet. But this is an ugly name, it's meaning, meaningless. So uh, it's better to control the name of these things. So what we can do uh, with the uh, Nisarco extension pack, Nisarco tools, I, I have this little utility cre name it, created name it objects create name it objects so in, instead of of this uh, auto naming uh, problem uh, we can create our own we can control our own names so I want to create a spreadsheet now so I want to create a spreadsheet and I select what is the name that I want so in this case I will call it for example I don't know dimensions or whatever okay so now this of ob this object is created and its internal name is what I said so I can I can create my data uh, put an alias and use this expression in my parametric things um, that is more um, readable and useful because you can you can select dimensions height okay and it works so now uh, your expression are more readable because you can control this kind of this naming things uh, th the same applies for parts cubes um, um, body parts etc because uh, if you never use this in expression there is no problem but if you need to use expression um, and you find some expression that says spreadsheet dot uh, height you don't know what it means but if you have many uh, spreadsheets for example I usually have um, many spreadsheets in the same model for example I, I have one spreadsheet usually uh, that I call uh, for, for example bearings uh, I also have um, bolts, usually I have uh, rails, so, and in my expressions, when I am designing things, and things say I select the, the proper um, group of parameters, for example, if, and when I design in a bearing for something or whatever, I said bearings that um, d or whatever parameter i have or collection of parameters i have in this spreadsheets so time uh, much time later when i read the model again etc and, and i see the expression i know what does this means uh, directly because if everything is called spreadsheet whatever is 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 not meaningful okay so I hope you enjoyed this extension, uh, that's it, thank you very much.